Recently, a good number of iPhone users have taken to various forums to report that the iOS 18 public beta is not showing up on their device. If you have also run into the same problem and therefore can't install the iOS 18 public beta on your iPhone, this video is for you. That said, let's fix the problem for good. First off, I would recommend you to make sure to check your device compatibility. Keep in mind that iOS 18 supports only iPhone XR, iPhone XS and later devices. Therefore, be sure that your iPhone is compatible to run the latest iteration of iOS. Then, I would recommend you to ensure that you have signed up for the Apple Beta program. Note that if you have not tried the iOS Beta before, make sure to sign up for the Apple Beta software program. To do so, open Safari on your iPhone and then go to Apple Beta Program website. After that, sign up for the Public Beta Program. Then you have to restart your iPhone. And once your iPhone has rebooted, go to the Settings app on your device and then select General. After that, select Software Update. Then select Beta Updates. And then choose iOS 18 Public Beta. Then you have to tap on the back button at the top left corner of the screen. And now wait for a few seconds to allow the iOS 18 public beta to show up on the screen. After that, you can download and install the iOS 18 beta just like any other update. However, if the iOS 18 public beta is still not showing up on your iPhone, it might be the after effect of a random software glitch. But bother or not, as the force restart may get rid of the glitch and bring the iOS 18 beta back on track. To do so, you have to press and release the volume up button, then you have to press and release the volume down button, and then you have to hold down the side button, aka the power button, until you see the Apple logo on the screen. And finally, I would suggest you to sign out of Apple ID and sign back in. If nothing has worked in fixing the iOS 18 public beta problem, I would recommend you to sign out of Apple ID and sign back in because it has worked wonders for many users. To do so, dive into the settings app on your iPhone. Then tap on the Apple ID banner at the top. Then select sign out. And after that, you have to keep a copy of all the important data and confirm the action. Then go back to the settings app on your device and then tap on Apple ID banner and sign in. And that's pretty much it. Hopefully, the iOS 18 public beta has finally appeared on your device and you have been able to install it as well. If you found this video helpful, do like, consider it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy iPhone tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a good time. Bye.